And if a woman stops sleeping with her man, I'm telling you right now, it is the man's fault. It's the man's fault, right? As men, we need to take responsibility for our actions and that, right? Yeah. 99.9% .9 of the time, right? A woman don't just stop sleeping with a man for the sake of stop sleeping with a man. That man has done something to lower her attraction, acting weak on this friendly vibe, acting like a fool, being all emotional, yeah? losing his temper and shit like that. Yeah? That's all feminine energy and stuff like that. Yeah? As I said earlier, yeah, acting out of emotion, losing your temper, that is feminine energy in it yeah depends on the situation obviously if a man squares up to you or whatever like, yeah i might lose my fucking temper yeah yeah they're gonna be some tempers flaring up in this motherfucker yeah yeah that's when i lose my temper or whatever isn't it? but you know if a woman like w women are like little fucking kids you know they they will they will try and tease you you know to try and get a reaction out of you yeah i see some little kids doing it the other day trying to tease the old lady next door yeah, trying to piss her off. Yeah, doing dumb stuff, right? And that's what women do. They try and tease. I've had girls try to tease me before. Yeah, and yeah, back then they did get a reaction. Yeah, they, they would just, you know, do stuff to piss you off. Right? That's why I said before in them live streams, women are like little children. If you don't believe me, if you don't believe me that women are like little children, some of them, a lot of them, and they act immature, go on to women's Instagrams yeah and just scroll through their videos and stuff like that and see how they conduct themselves when they're with their friends go on to certain women's youtube channels right they could be between the age of 20 and 40 years old or maybe 50 years old to blood clot yeah watch their videos when they're with their friends and how they're acting and stuff and think to yourself would a man act like that and if you think that a man wouldn't act like that it's probably because they're acting immature and childish yeah? Maybe some women watching this right now live or watching this um, on, on, on replay or whatever, in it, yeah? Ask yourself, if you're a woman, do we act immature and a bit childish when I'm with my friends? Yeah, when it's just us lot in a room or whatever, in it, yeah? They do. Not all. Not all, obviously. Not all of them. But a lot of them do. And that's why when a guy starts acting childish and, yeah, yeah all that foolishness, yeah, that's like feminine energy and then... You know, a woman don't want to sleep with a woman unless she's that way inclined, isn't it? Yeah. So that's when she becomes the more masculine one and she don't want to sleep with 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 a quote unquote woman. So that's why she emasculates you by sending you to sleep downstairs on the sofa. Yeah. One of my brethren, right? He um I don't know if he's hooked up with this girl, but he went to a girl's house one time, right? And he said that the ex-boyfriend was on the run, right? And he said he went into the house and the ex-boyfriend was sleeping on the sofa and he was just in the house talking to the girl, right? I can guarantee you 110 million percent she is not sleeping with that um, ex-boyfriend, right? Obviously, he's on the run, so he's just shacking up in the house, hiding from the police, right? But he is so low down the ranks, right, that she doesn't even see him as a man. She's lost so much attraction for him that she even feels comfortable to bring another man into that house, right? Now, my friend who went there, he's a masculine-looking guy, and so whatever, however the boy, however the guy looks that, you know, who the ex-boyfriend is sleeping on so far, I doubt he looks more masculine or whatever than my friend anyway, innit? But it don't really matter, innit, yeah? Her, she has lost so much attraction for her ex, right, that she feels comfortable to bring another male in his presence, yeah? He's only there because he's on the run from the police and she probably feels sorry for him. He probably, he probably begged her, innit, because I doubt, you know, they put his face up on ITV's Most Wanted and she phoned him, oh, oh, um, you know, big killer from South London, um, you know, do, do you want to come stay at my house? Because I've seen you, you, you're wanted by the police. No, he probably begged her. She was like, all right, then pussy, I'll come sleep on, come sleep on the sofa. Yeah. She's lost so much attraction for him that she doesn't even see him as a man like that to the point where she feels comfortable to bring another man into the house in his presence. My friend said to, said, said to me, he walked in, he saw the guy on the sofa. He's like, what the fuck? But obviously, she told him, oh, my ex is in the house. With him. He just rolled over, looked at him, and then roll back over, yeah? carried on sleeping.
you know, Mr. Euro is a proper Jamaican, you know. Called me general. Only Jamaicans talk like that. <laughs> Man, talking about acting like Mr. Bean, you know. Listen, the other day, right, Nadia was at my house, innit, yeah? And I was showing her some girl, um, we ain't offering no names, yeah, but there's a girl that was uh, exposed for uh, black fishing, yeah? Black fishing, where white girls make themselves look like they're either mixed race or black, right? Now, I actually got that girl's number, innit, yeah? Never linked to her, nothing like that. She weren't interested, she just gave me her number, whatever, innit? Yeah? Anyway, boom. She's got a YouTube channel now and an Instagram page, isn't it? Yeah. And I was showing Nadia the videos, whatever, and I was like, a guy is not supposed to be acting like that with his girlfriend, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah, like he's just acting just dumb, just acting stupid with his girlfriend. Right? Like acting like they're like acting like they're fucking friends. Yeah. Low, I'm telling you, right. It's only a matter of time when she's going to not be interested in no more, in it, yeah? I, I, guy acting like a fucking fool, yeah? Hey, guys! Uh, yeah? That's not manly, that's not sexy. Yeah, and girls, the attractive girl, innit, yeah? So, one day she's going to think to herself, nah, man, you're not acting manly enough for me, man. I'm going to find myself a real man, and then boom, he's out of there. And what's going to happen, he's probably going to go on, when she breaks up with him, which is going to be a test, He's probably going to cry on the phone, beg the girl back, please, I, I love you. Yeah, we're playing Joel to see tracks in the back while he's begging her on the phone and that. And then she's just going to, yeah, right, you, you, you failed my test because you're acting like a, like, like, like you're my friend. You're acting like a, you're one of the bitches, right? And then I've broken up with you and you've acted like a bitch by calling me and begging me. So, yeah, acting like a fucking kid. So look, so 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 Nadia is saying I'm crazy when I'm with my friends, and with Jay I'm um she's calm and whatever in it. Yeah, yeah, we ain't playing all these games and playing Twister and stuff. No, in the kitchen, go make some food, go cook, girl. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's how I have to. I'm joking. You don't have to be like that in it. Yeah, your woman not your slave or nothing like that. But yeah, yeah, we yeah we ain't on a yeah. We, no, we ain't no game playing it. Don't get interested in it. You can have a laugh, have fun, yeah, but there has to be, yeah, it's easy, trust me. Like, looking back on it now, I'm like, oh, my God, man. If only I knew back then, right, what I know now. But you have to make these mistakes in order to, you know, learn from them, right? You have to make these mistakes in order to maybe get some knowledge somewhere and even be able to identify the mistakes you've made and then see it happening with other people and then even watching it, right? And because the thing is, right, I could I could observe couples, right? Yeah. And tell a man, you're acting too friendly with your girl or whatever, innit? Yeah. Let's just say, yeah, for an example, innit? A man will get vexed with me and be like, no, you don't know what you're talking about. And then in a year's time, they've broken up, right? And it just boggles his mind as to why, I, you know, I told her I love her, you know, I've done everything for her, innit? Like, I'll pick her up from work. Um, You know, if she asks me to go to the shop, or, you know, if she asks to make a fucking cup of tea, I'll do it. I don't know why she broke up with me. I treated her like a queen and that. It's because of certain things, yeah, maybe like that friendly vibe, other stuff as well, isn't it? Yeah? So there's a certain time I can sit back and just watch and just wait. It's only a ticking time, but a minute, it's only a matter of time. It's either that she's going to break up with him or... She's just gonna emasculate him and make him her bitch, yeah. But a certain man, you have this conversation with them, and they'd be like, No, you're a madman, innit? You don't know what you're talking about. And then a year later, two years later, when he's sleeping on the sofa, he ain't sniffing no pussy in a in, in couple months or whatever, yeah. He's gonna wonder what's what's going on, innit? Yeah. Well, I try to tell you what's going on, innit? Yeah. Or whatever, innit? Yeah. So there's certain times I just sit back and watch certain situations because there's certain men, right? You can't even tell them about this stuff, in it, because they they just won't understand it, innit? Yeah. That's probably just their nature, innit? Acting all friendly with their girl and acting all like Mr. Bean or whatever, innit? Yeah. And for them to not do that is like you're changing their character. They don't want to change, but change must happen or you're going to lose your woman. Yeah. So, yeah, there's certain time I could just sit back and watch. And just, it's only a matter of time. It may be six months. It may be a year. It may be three years. But this thing's going to go sour, isn't it? Yeah? 
if she hasn't already made him the bitch. Yeah, shit. Like I said in those videos, if your woman is fiery, right, and your woman is like disrespectful and stuff like that, right. You are acting in your feminine energy or whatever, innit? Yeah? Like you see with Nadia, yeah. Nadia tells me, right, that you know, with other guys, she's like a, you know, this and that or whatever, innit? Yeah, she's fiery, innit? I don't see that. <laughs> I don't see that. Yeah. I don't see that side, innit? Yeah, because she's told me stories where, you know, guys worship the ground, she walks on and shit like that. I don't do that bullshit. Yeah, I don't do that bullshit. And then she just treats them like shit. Then don't get into say, listen. I've treated girls well and then being treated like shit. Don't get it twisted, but man's had to make those mistakes to, to, to understand, you know, where I've gone wrong.